it's time to check out another hidden gem in Austin. Well, somewhat in Austin. And before we get started, I want to give a quick shout out to NutriChamps. They are the sponsor of this video. NutriChamps delivers nutritional supplements that help people throughout their journey towards achieving optimal health, wealth, and longevity. Me and my wife use their products and various products for that matter throughout our days, whether it be their gummies, whether it be their drinks, uh, their shakes, everything about them is all natural and great. So if you feel like you're missing out on those key nutrients, vitamins, and nutrition within your diet, go ahead and give them a check out down below. You can use the code modified and CD to get up to 30% off on any item that you order or for your entire purchase. Thanks. Welcome to the Missing Hotel. I always find something a little unique and I uh, found another Austin hidden gem slash outside of Austin. And we are going to spend the night here. This is an igloo type hotel. All scattered outside of Marble Falls, Texas I should say. And uh, it is in the shape of an igloo but it has all the essentials that you need. AC, shower, toilets, um, and they're all, they're kind of scattered out amongst each other. You have your own little plunge pool, as Babe said. How are you supposed to get into that little pool? <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of small, but I think it's just for you to kind of dip yourself into in some of this Texas heat, but it gives you a cool open sensation to see all of the Texas Hill Country and uh, it's not too bad. Um, there's no TV, but there's record players. They have an Alexa out here for you if you want to just listen to music and have a good time. I think it's great for, for couples who want to just spend some quality time together. So we are here and we're going to check out just the missing hotel. I'm coming. Babe is putting together food. So there, there is like uh, grocery stores and stuff before you get down this way. It is off the beaten path, but there are things along your journey that you can pick up and bring here and have already set up. And the unit that we are in are is the Mori. Now there are other igloo out here, um, but I don't know if all of the layouts are different um, because they do have various names for the igloo pods. Uh, so we are getting ready to get down with some food. Ooh, you got your little stuff in there. Yeah. Hi guys. So the lady of the hour. Tomorrow's my birthday, and Babe decided to bring me here, and also do a vlog. Of course, so you know we're gonna do a vlog, no matter what kind of day it is. <laughs> um, but it's beautiful. Oh. You know, he always have to look out for his sister. Hey, y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, guys, um, we're going to enjoy the moment. And they also have a hammock, like, right outside. Yeah. So, this is something so beautiful. Yeah. We're literally looking at the outside. And it's like sitting outside camping but not really camping you know yeah you're comfortable with the ac and stuff inside of here but you have this full view of everything yeah so it's um it's really nice babe, isolated babe got fruit we got we got charcuterie plates we got fruit we got mushrooms and crab meat we just grabbed a whole bunch of stuff i'm gonna show you guys the layout okay give me a moment yeah so guys so for the spread, I have shrimp. I have like imitation like crab leg meat. 
uh, Mediterranean hummus, some pita bread, fried chicken, <laughs> um, pepperoni, cheese, fruit, sauteed mushrooms, and also green olives. So I thought that would be kind of nice instead of us trying to go out and get anything. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty good. Pretty good. I don't know why I got a plate. I felt like it's just me and her. We could have just dug into this stuff ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> you should have won't drop anything and we want to make sure you keep these clean, so. I hate you. Mm -hmm. It's good. We just decided to come out here, get away from it all for a second, mm -hmm. and enjoy some of this, what this hill country has to offer. So, from us to y'all. <laughs> Enjoy, guys. Mm. We will for you, I should say. What is going on, good peoples? And thank you for continuing to rock with us. Now, after that long intro, let's go ahead and introduce you to the Missing Hotel Shelter. Give you a full tour. As you walk into this place, you can see it's very quaint and cozy, just like I had said it before. It's not much to it, but it is a beautiful location. A good place for you to disconnect from distractions and reconnect with yourself. I love the hospitality of everything that's set up because you don't see anyone on the property when you get there. So as you come in, you have your bedroom, uh, you have kind of your little small dining area, there's a kitchen area, fully stocked with coffee, a microwave, there's a small refrigerator, and I love the little touches that they leave behind, you know, little cards with our names on it, uh, kind of a, a, a menu or so of what the things are around the area that you can do, restaurants, and everything of that nature. Um, it comes equipped for you to kind of bring your own stuff and be able to survive while you're out there, which is really good. Uh, the bed, it was really comfortable. Uh, you, you know, you don't know what you're going to get. It's not a full-blown hotel, but it was really good. It came with a full Wi-Fi. There was AC. There was a small Alexa there. So everything went well. As you turn the corner, you'll see you have a Nest thermostat. And you have a little bench where you can keep your stuff and a nice size mirror for you to kind of look at and get yourself prepared before you go out into nothingness I should say around the corner there is a full shower full shower um, I was very surprised by this full shower but the water pressure was good uh, the water was hot uh, so it was, it was great you have your sink uh, they came stocked full of towels washcloths and then a composite toilet which was different for us and new uh, I know on other channels there's people who have had these composite toilets whether it be in their campers or just in other uh, sites that they've been to but it was a first for us now getting lost and disappearing in the woods doesn't have to be a bad thing and this right here showcased it and why and we really enjoyed it and definitely will come back and try uh, some of their other shelters that we have um, if you imagine a place that makes you feel like you're experiencing what's right in front of you and that's all that matters, you would enjoy it. People who like to just kind of spend time with themselves really would, would fall in love with this place. Um, throughout your travels, uh, the nature parks and the walks and all that they have, we spend a good majority of time just to us um, and outside. And it wasn't too hot when we were here. Uh, I think it was uh, uh, just a, a well-nourished and reinvigorating place to be at. <sighs> so we pretty much ate all of those snacks until we decided to just get full. Now we came outside and sat down. Enjoy the rest of this beautiful overcast skies. Let's do some music. She's enjoying herself. So it's, it's one of those treasures you gotta remember.
tried to play a little bit of Wheel of Fortune uh, until it got too dark outside. Mm -hmm. I don't know where the the little beaded lights that are hanging come on or what time they come on, but we played for a little bit. Old bamboozled Dollar General Wheel of Fortune game. <laughs> it was good though. They said it was good. To me it was. They got it freezing in here. But you know what? It's on 70. This is a nice Nest thermostat, the new one. And um, you need it in this Texas heat, so I'm not going to complain. Well, can we cut it down? Yeah, we can. So about a little bit ways through our game of spades, these lights came on. Yeah. You can have a party out here. But it sounds like some animals in the trees, so I'm getting back in the house. It's a bird. Uh-uh. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that bird. <laughs> She's like, no, we can't have you, sir. <laughs> making, this no making this noise right outside this igloo. I mean, <laughs> I mean it's all plastic and... <laughs> Uh, you know, stencil set up here, so it's not like it's you can't hear nothing from outside. <laughs> Unless you. Excuse me. <clears throat> Alright, so you're gonna um, teach me how to play cards now? Yeah. Okay. Alright, Good morning, good people. So yesterday, we just kind of played games until the sun went down. Ah, we watched a couple of episodes of Ptolemy Gray on Apple TV Plus, and we got some good night rest out in the wilderness, as I like to call it. <laughs> but it was nice. Uh, we had a good breeze and um, just an enjoyable night, uh, being able to see the view the entire way it was it was it was gorgeous the entire night and then of course I thought it was gonna be raining this morning and thundering and stuff but it wasn't we had a beautiful sunrise now also what's cool about this property is that they have a Tesla charger so we were debating if we were just gonna drive my car or the Tesla and you guys know with the gas prices now what they're going through we wanted to drive the Tesla so I mapped out you know little um, supercharger locations and stuff like that and um didn't really even need it they have a nice level two charger right here um there's several people out here with teslas as well so they just ask you to be courtesy of your time so i woke up this morning while nobody's there and just decided to come out so yeah it's nice it's a lot of different properties out here um and a little little cool features on how to get to your property like behind me you have to just know what your property looks like. Your each property has a symbol. And our son, where we stayed, the Mori, uh, was pointing this way. So we just had to drive down this way. And I tell you, uh, <laughs> there is no other type of internet connection out here except for their Wi-Fi. And it is kind of limited. So, um, yeah, you might want to just be prepared for that. Now, by far, one of the best key elements of this entire property was that I have spoken to absolutely no one. 
it is 2022 and I feel everything that we do has some way of being able to take care of these things at your own leisure. Um, shouldn't have to always have to call people and wait on them and a call back or, you know, they're there if you need them and you have all types of ways of getting in contact with them. But as I, I was able to go online to the site, see what days were open, what property was open, make my payment. I received a text message the day before we were coming here just to make sure that we registered, gave us all the rules and layout. Then they sent us another text message that gave you a map of the land, where to go, where your property is, the code to get in, and then also the code to get into your place where you're staying, whether it's one of the dome igloo shaped spots or they're more, I, I like to call them little small cabin, outdoor cabin types. Um, but it's definitely been a unique experience and it's been a great experience because I've had not one issue and I haven't had to talk to anybody. I think there is on-site staff here in case you do, so they equipped you with like little walkie talkies uh, in case you need anything or something breaks. But um, yeah, we had a perfect time and um, just waking up this morning, making some coffee, being outside, listening to the birds, just enjoying like the way that we had our set up, you could see literally through the trees and it looked good like I don't know what the other locations look like but what we had was really great CD is getting herself together it is her birthday so um, I'm gonna head back down I plugged the car up and I'm walking back to where we are let's catch some of these views while I'm out there